Yo, what is up and good morning everyone. Hope you guys are having a great day. It is a great day to wake up and chase after your dreams. Thank you guys for tuning into another video. So it's another video of the off season grind. Now today's video is gonna be a little bit different because we started off later in the day, um, but it's January 3rd right now. It's actually my mom's birthday today. And um, it's been a year since I've been home and since I've seen my mom, um, cause she's only just gotten back last week. So me and my sister, we decided we're gonna make some breakfast for her. Um, just make her feel special, obviously, um, like anyone would do on their birthdays. And she's done so much for me throughout my whole um, life and I can never repay her. So um, we, make, we just made some breakfast. Uh, yesterday we had some family members over and um, we had uh, dinner last night. So I woke up this morning, I woke up around eight o'clock, um, did the dishes, did some work. Um, around the kitchen and then um, started making some breakfast. So uh, we're gonna head in the dining room. We're gonna eat together um, and kind of just get ready for today's um, day. I think we have a double session later on today. We're gonna be training with Ibi and we're also gonna be training with the PDP program um, at OPSM. So hopefully you guys like this video. Hopefully you guys are enjoying the off season. Drop a like down below, drop a comment. I wish my mom a birthday in the comment down below. Um, but yeah, if you guys are new, make sure you guys subscribe and I'll see you guys in the video. Let's go. Yer. Yo, so just before the video gets started, guys, I wanted to announce something to you guys. Now, this clip was shot a couple days later than the vlog. So it is Sunday that you guys are watching this today and tomorrow will be Monday. So starting tomorrow, OPSM, we're going to be running online technical training sessions on Monday, Wednesdays and Fridays. And if you guys are looking to get any extra sessions in, any extra touches, they're open to anyone around the world. So I have everything in the description below. If you guys want to get in that extra work, it's going to be super easy. I'll have everything in the description below. Um, drop a comment if you guys are interested or you'll see everything down below. All right. So once again, the session are going to run from Monday, Wednesdays, and Fridays. They're going to be run by me, one hour sessions, and it's just going to be um, technical work. So um, hope you guys enjoyed the video and let's get into the vlog. Peace. All right, good morning, guys. We got my sister. We got Noah. Wait. Say hi, Noah. And hi. as I told you guys, it's my mom's birthday. What's up, mother? Hi. <laughs> <laughs> so we've got breakfast. We got some hash browns, croissant, eggs, bacon, and, and then forget my this. mom is getting younger and younger. Don't forget this. And don't forget the chocolate teams. That's right. We're gonna eat this. Did you forget hang out for a little bit, teams. right, guys? Right. Yeah. And then we also have to sing happy birthday to my mother. Yeah! yeah. yeah. All right, y'all, so just a quick update for you guys. It is qu currently 12 p.m. right now. Um, so I spent some time with my family. We had breakfast, chilled with my mom, my nephew, and my sister. Um, I, obviously, you guys know I've been gone for so long, and that's another thing that you guys usually don't usually see is me spending time with my family. And it's just been amazing to be back, especially you haven't um, seen them in such a long time. You know, whenever I come back home, I always really try and cherish those moments and spend as much time as I can with my family. So um, with that being said, I was supposed to head out soon and run around and do some things for the combine. But Ontario has legit just this morning just announced that they're going to be on lockdown for two weeks starting on Wednesday. And the combine was supposed to be on that Wednesday. So um, all the things that I was supposed to get done today, um, I'm still waiting to see if I have to do that. Right now, I'm kind of just chilling, just um, answering some emails and sending out some emails because we are going to start training. Hopefully, we can start training, um, technical training here in Ottawa, and I'm going to be running it. Um, so I'm just sending out some emails, getting some things all prepared for that. Um, and hopefully soon we can go out of lockdown and, and do that. So that's what I'm going to be doing for probably the next hour or so. Hang out here, chill for a little bit and then um, head out because we still have a gym session later at 3 p.m. And then we have a um, technical session tonight. So you guys will still get to see a double day 
of trading um, as usual, but we're just going to chill for a little bit and then I'll catch up with you guys soon. So peace. Yo, so it is currently 2 p.m. right now. We are in the Dollarama parking lot. So Noah's got some money for um, as his Christmas present. So he's in there he's buying some toys, doing some shopping, some of those things. So we're just waiting inside for him. We're gonna drop him and my sister off at home. And then we've got a session at three o'clock. So it's a lower body session today. Um, we haven't squatted in a while. So hopefully we can get to squat a little bit. And I'll be honest with you guys, the past couple weeks have been kind of hard with my diet, but um, I have um, gained a little bit of pounds, you know, being back home with my um, mom cooking and stuff. So. Um, um, it's been kind of tough, but this week is a week that we get back and we get back to seriously um, being on our diet. So you guys know already how much I struggle with my um, diet plans and all that stuff. So this week should be the week that we get back into it, the week where everything um, gets back into place. Unfortunately, we are going into lockdown, but we still are going to find ways to do technical sessions and physical sessions. So um, I'm probably just going to be chilling in the car for the next 20 minutes. I'm going to throw on the wolves and the Man United game kick back and then um, I'll see you guys once we get to the gym with AB, so peace. Back in the dungeon. Not the boys. AB, what are you saying? It's so cold, huh? Minus 30 outside. It's freezing, guys. It's freezing. But you guys haven't really seen. You guys saw the back of it, but. Yeah, of course, bro. Look, Messi's got the crown. Hey, I know there's some Ronaldo fans have watched me, but Ronaldo's up there. But, yeah, this is it. What's up, bro? You good? You ready? Good. How you been? Blessed? All good. First winter in Canada, right? Cold. Cold, freezing? I swear, like, bro, like my, my eyebrows were frozen, bro. <laughs> Welcome to Canada. Hey, my son. I'm good, man. What's up? You blessed? Long time, man. Yeah, yeah. All right, y'all. Let's get this work. Yo, what is up? And welcome to The Voice Over, y'all. Now, if you guys are watching the video till this far and you guys haven't subscribed yet, it would mean a lot to me. Hit that subscribe button. Drop a like. Now, you guys have seen the Ninja Walks and my past videos. You guys know it how much I dread these exercises, but um, they're really good exercise for you guys to warm up. So um, as I said in the last video, we always do the same type of warm up. So we do 10 yards going forwards. We'll start with our ninja walks and then we'll do the ninja walks going sideways. So as you guys will see, we're taking little steps and trying to get as deep as we can. And every step you take, you squat down. Next up is another warm up that you guys have seen me done multiple times before. Now, this is one that I've done throughout the whole year, even during my season um, back in Indiana. You guys have been seeing me doing all the banded walks. So we start off by going forwards, 10 steps forwards, 10 steps back. And then we also go sideways, 10 steps and 10 steps back. Um, so we did a little bit different today. We did the double band, which was my first time trying it out. You really got to feel it in your glutes. And you guys will see the next one, same type of thing, working on opening up the glutes using the red band. All right, y'all. So you guys know how much I've added squats into my workout routine throughout the whole year. Um, just to increase that power in my um, glutes. So we started off with just back squat. I haven't done back squats like this in a while. So it felt really, really good to be back. So you guys will see we did the seated squats where you go down for three seconds and then you try and explode all the way up. So using that power from the bench and exploding as soon as you feel um, that you touch the bench, you wanna explode right up. So we did six reps of four sets. So for our first superset, we got into box jumps. 
So right after we finish with our squats, we would come over and do four um, sets of five reps of the box jump. So right after you finish your squats, you come on over and you're working on exploding off the ground and working on that light landing. Now, on our last rep of our squats, we added squat jumps, which are weighted. So we added two more supersets just to get that extra work in. And then we also added um, the banded squat jumps. So you guys will see, I'm just trying to get low and using that band to explode up. So um, next up, we got into the Bulgarian split squat. Um, now, you guys know I'm not a big fan of these, but so good for you guys to build that strength in your quads and your glutes. So Bulgarian split squats, we got into that. We did eight reps on both sides, and then we supersetted it with a one leg um, squat jump. So right after you did your Bulgarian split squats, we supersetted it with one leg box jumps. So same focus, trying to explode off the ground and work on that light landing. So for our next exercise, we worked on to the side lunges. So the goal is to try and step as far as you can and try and dip your glutes all the way down. So you guys will see as I step out, I try and go all the way down and try and get really, really good depth. So just the side lunges, we worked on 10 reps and four sets. So you guys will see right after we got into this exercise, we did our super set. Now the next exercise, this was my first time doing it, is just banded footwork into an explosive jump. So you're stepping across over the hurdles and then you're jumping as soon as you come back up. So quick little step over. And then once you come back to the other side, you jump over. So same thing on the other side, we did four reps of three sets. So for the last four exercises, we got into some conditioning and core. We started off with the hollow holds and also the plank driving your knees up all the way to your elbows. Now we did this in the Tabata. So 20 seconds on, 10 seconds off, and then we would rotate in between exercises, and we did that for four sets. So um, right after we finished our core, we got into the single leg hops um, for conditioning. Now, this is an exercise that is a lot harder um, than it looks. So it looks pretty easy, but you're just working on trying to hop over, working on that power to explode all the way over the bench. So just working on that one leg to get up and over. And then the last exercise of the day was just the um, rope swings. So for 20 seconds on, we would rope swing and switch in between that and the bench to go over with our one leg hops. Ah, right, what's up, y'all? So it is currently 5.40 right now. Just a quick update for you guys. So we got that leg workout done. Um, and I know I haven't done a heavy leg workout like that in a while. So it was really good to get that in. And unfortunately, I have bad news. So originally, we had a session tonight in Ben Franklin Dobe. Um, obviously, since there is new restrictions here in Ottawa, they've opted out. So we don't have a session tonight, unfortunately. So I'm probably just going to head home, finish some work that I had to do. I'm thinking about... Maybe there might be some little exercises that I can do at home or possibly do a yoga um, session. Just depends on what time I get back home and after I eat and all that stuff. So um, I wanted to give you guys a quick update. Very unfortunate, but um, lockdowns happen here like all the time. So sucks, but we're just going to head back home and do what we got to do. So I'll see you guys once we get back to the house. Ooh, yo, I'm all up for snow, y'all. But seriously... Oh my days, I am all up for snow, but this cold, kid you not, it is not playing games. It's like minus what? It's like minus 20 today, y'all. Can you guys believe it? Minus 20, it's too cold. Gotta get home. Just got home. Oh, it's a little brisk. It's brisk. Grab my bag. Get my butt inside, y'all. If you're outside of Canada right now, enjoying whatever weather you have, enjoy it. Oh! <laughs> I 
All right, y'all, I'm not even gonna hold you guys. I was so hungry, I couldn't even wait. As soon as I got home, washed my hands, and then I got some leftovers. So these are the last bit of the leftovers. Um, I have to do some groceries for the rest of the week, but we got some Haitian salad, some potato salad. There's some potatoes and then also beets and some eggs in there. And then we've got a little bit of goat meat right over here. So you guys can see all my Haitians will know how good this is. We got a chicken wing that was an appetizer. And then we've got Haitian black rice. So that's going to be our dinner for tonight. As you guys can see, I still have all my stuff on. I'm going to down this and then I'll catch up with you guys after. So peace. Yo, so it is currently 6.45. We just finished dinner. We're now snacking on an apple. Um, so I was thinking about it and... I know in my last video, I told you guys about how much I want to get done this year. So instead of doing like a yoga workout, whatever it is that I, the extra that I was going to do, I think I'm going to focus on the next two hours and get as much work as I can done. So obviously with lockdown, we're not allowed to have um, domes or anything open. So training is going to be hard. We're going to have to find a way to do it online and then also work on my technical training program guide. Now, I know I've said this so many times before. Um, that I'm creating a guide, but I wanted to give you guys a little bit of insight behind it. So what I want to do is I want to create something where players like yourselves that's watching um, can have a guide that you guys can follow. And I know many players, do, many um, YouTubers do this, but it's going to be a little different. Um, I'm thinking of switching it up and making it a guide where you guys can follow, follow along with me and basically improve your technical ability. So I'll have like everything for you guys to see. Um, I'll have a diagram of it and I'll also have videos in the, in the in the program so you guys could follow along but you guys will also have me um, with you guys and so it's it's basically for a lot younger footballers who are looking to improve and get more composed on the ball and get better technically so um, that's what I really want to focus on and this is the year where we want to do as much as we can so I think over the next two hours I'm just going to sit back and dial in really dial into this and try and work in as much as I can. So finish editing my video, of course, work on different programs, work on some online training stuff. And then in about two hours or so, I'll probably hit the hay, um, get off to bed early because I've been sleeping really late these past couple days. So it's gonna be it's gonna be really nice to get back into bed early. So you now I'm gonna do that for the next hour, uh, two hours, and then I'll catch up with you guys after that. Probably throw on some Netflix or something. So um, I'll see you guys soon. It's time to get serious, man. It's easy to say it when you can't even explain, but I'm trying to go past that and dive into my brain. I'm one of a kind nigga. Alright, y'all. So it is currently nine o'clock right now. Your boy is super tired. I got all my work done. I just hopped out the shower. I'm feeling fresh, all ready to go to bed. I'm actually watching Netflix right now. I got on a movie called Hitch. It's an older movie. Um, it's pretty funny, just romantic comedy. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys are new, make sure you guys hit that subscribe button. Drop a comment. Let me know what you guys would like to see, whether it's full technical training session, more training videos, full day of eating. Just drop a comment down below. Let me know what you guys would like to see. Thank you for all the love, all the support. I'll see you guys in the next video. Thank you. Peace. It's easy to say it when you can't even explain, but I'm trying to go past that and dive into my brain. I'm one of a kind. I'm idiosyncratic, spitting in my attic, charged with no static.